So, the Dharmakaya prayer is uh, written by the great Dzogchen master, Sharja uh, Rinpoche, Tashi Jansen. Usually people say Sharja Rinpoche, Sharja Tashi Jansen. So he uh, was born uh, in uh, 1859 and passed into Nirvana, uh, achieved him by 1935. So this, uh, the uh, prayer is uh, actually the oral transmission of the Dharmakaya. Uh, emanation of Dharmakaya, so uh, which is the uh, the final the information uh, says there uh, there is a, a emanation of Dharmakaya, uh, very uh, small uh, body, light body, talk him this uh, prayers. And same that topic, he written down. So therefore, uh, uh, this is uh, actually the oral translation of the Dharmakaya. So, uh, uh, usually we have the uh, three purses for all Dharma activities. The first, uh, I have correct motivation and old sentient banks. And uh, uh, second, what we have do, particular today, the recite the prayer. And finally, third one, the dedication, what we did. So that is give for or every sentient beings for remove their uh, negative energy and uh, uh, remove their uh, suffering and uh, the uh, <clears throat> ignorance. And then uh, there's the uh, get the, uh, happiness temporarily and ultimately. So that is the whole dedication. So in this uh, prayer, there's in the topic, uh, including, included the all of the uh, purpose, purpose, uh, what we say, the, the motivation, and actual practice and education, everything including there. So uh, today is the very special uh, Shakyamuni is uh, the Sagadava, uh, part of Sagadava. And uh, uh, also uh, we had the we had the Nagasutta a uh, few months every Saturday. It is the temporarily finished right now, or in the in, in the future, occasionally we we will uh, learn that uh, continually, maybe next year. So therefore, this is a part of the dedication also. Uh, become dedication and uh, 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 particularly uh, uh, we have in global pandemic under this issue around uh, 37 million over 37 million people 
dry the in over two years. So uh, right now the um in Sagadava Dam. So we uh, pray for them. And we uh, think about and those people. Uh, the future love is getting wonderful opportunity to get also uh, precious dharma and uh, so connect to the nature of mind. So uh, this, this is very uh, uh, important time to the prayers for them. Okay. So therefore, uh, very good opportunity to ask for the correct time, the correct purpose, the correct practice and prayers. Even we have a lot of ex experiences for the for you, the meditation and the meaning and understand. It is more powerful for uh, uh, prayers. So then um, also please you think about the other sentient beings, everyone, including uh, your, you have more connection, closer, closer, family and friends and whatever, that's you. Uh, visualize also be together everyone today uh, doing this practice okay good so then after finish for recite prayer so we have uh, the question and answer section so if you have question in in this meaning what do you have something dot or the or you have special um, you want to uh, take a question so so we we have that space also today okay thank you so we recite uh, from uh, our own home from this this way before that no no necessary read okay <clears throat> one second <clears throat> Also, uh, we have the here show this uh, skin, and but uh, if you you want to also uh, download or reading through the uh, website, and you can go ahead also there uh, available. Okay. <clears throat> Uh, um, um, the sense of I and the world talk beyond thought is not awakened by effort because it always has been. Sentient beings <coughs> undeceived <coughs> abide <clears throat> sorry in pure open expense before the arising of samsara and nirvana is the original king pristine awareness 
the true nature of <clears throat> sap is beyond explaining not outside inside <clears throat> or in building open um impeded it is the basis of <clears throat> both samsara and nirvana the manifestations of i are and ceasing within and ceasing manifestation anything can appeal at first why lights appeal those with sharp awarenesses instantly recognize it as their own manifestation and it is sub liberated in the next instant may or sentient beings of the three realms reach the kingdom of samanda padara if the mind is darkened by oppression it clings to duality not recognizing the manifestations as it is own when beings wander onto a mistaking path may they obtain a good form in a pure realm see the face of the holy guru and taste the nectar of their speech may their minds be repent by the profound four initiations and may uh, realization and liberation be simultaneous in this way the phenomena of samsara and nirvana are created by the samanda badra i the i likes a, a, a separate basis or root it abides in great primordial uh, basel baselessness in <clears throat> an ending display without foundation or phenomena appears as emanated illusions or sentient beings of the three realms are not separate from the samen badra i i am the first buddha may or sentient beings realize the same phenomena made by samenda padara i those that appear and those that don't have never been inherently existence just as dream awareness gives rise to false appearances during dreams or phenomena appear yet do not exist like the inseparability of ice and water there is no separation between all things and myself it is primordial economity of singer taste this white eye samanda badra say may or beings realize it therefore all phenomena are my manifestation samsara and nirvana indivisible buddhas and sentient beings non dual no abandon uh, donning delusions or adopting wisdom no separate happiness and suffering or are equal in my reality this pure awareness free of rejection or approval i samanda badra reveal may it be realized just as i 
teach it. That's all phenomena. Within baseless, rootlessness spontaneously appear and are liberated within me. All existing phenomena are well established, yet their essence is empty space. I don't say they are truly existing. May all sentient beings be freed by this view of great transcendent wisdom. Like planets and stars appearing in the ocean or appearing existent phenomena arise as manifestations of body chitta. May all be liberated by this meditation that is free from accepting and rejecting. Through this, I summon the Bhadra's prayer. All phenomena of samsara and nirvana do not arise. They are manifestations of the base. With knowledge of sub-arising, transcendent wisdom welling up. It is like having gone to an island of gold and jewels. Conduct is spontaneous manifestation of the base. May sentient beings realize it. I, Dharmakaya, my ultimate nature, does not exist as sub or other but is not missing inside or outside. Delusion and transcendent wisdom are non-dual. This samaya that is beyond keeping or uh, tongues grazing is the primordial samaya that I explained. May all sentient beings of the three realms abide in this samaya that is beyond commitment. Present appearance and awareness unmodified, just as they are primarily appearing and dissolving, is sub arising transcendent wisdom. Without abandoning, grasping is natural, naturally realized. Without adopting, awareness is automatically heard. Innate luminosity flows without interruption. This is called the uh, primarily attained great result. I, Samedha Bhadra, explain it. May all sentient beings realize it. In, inside a sub uh, er, erizen, uh, palace, a tent of five lights. At the heart of each individual is Samedha Bhadra, bright and alert. Abiding in the singular great uh, indivisibility of three, uh, of three uh, essence, nat uh, nature, and compassion, without inside or outside, everywhere, abiding primordial without object without gaining or losing the uh, enlightened bodies and wisdoms. The oral instructions of great perfection chosen shine by way of the individual's lamps. <clears throat> Seeing the original Buddha in actual 
May all sentient beings know this. From the manifestation of our awareness, appear lights and rays and ill. Uh, <clears throat> arising from outer and inner space, incredibly uh, in direct perception, <clears throat> like the sun and its rays. They effortlessly, spontaneously shine forth. May all beings of the three realms, without exception, have increasing manifestations of luminosity, dharma kaya, rupa kaya, or appearances of the three bodies. <clears throat> arise as the manifestation of my awareness. May <clears> our <throat> sentient beings in samsara see the three kayas <clears throat> by way of their lens and cut through all appearances of the path. For all those who hear my prayer, may your things uh, dispel, uh, dispel into clear light mind. May their form aggregate disappear into light and ordinary mind into pristine awareness. What happen, uh, happens with these three uh, <clears throat> disappearance? The great exhaustion of uh, intellect and phenomena. Is that guys in the young, a young drone, a body of great uh, transference without abandoning this body? Like this, may or be liberated in the young drone body. May the <clears throat> immortal Samboga Kayas taking birth and engaging with inconceivable emanations fully accomplish the welfare of sentient beings. And may I and all others, without exception, attain <clears throat> the youthful base body. If they have weaker karma and uh, perseverance and are not liberated in this life when their mind departs from their body through clairvoyance and memory may they be able to attain liberation in the pardo and reach, uh, reach the kingdom of Samenda Padra. At that time, may the 45 peaceful deities and the 80 rival ones be spontaneously realized as the display of awareness, saying this mandala of great spontaneity. May all sentient beings know it as the manifestation of their own awareness at that time from their cor uh, corpse, uh, their uh, ordinary form aggregate from five types of special uh, relic pills, Shari Ram, Bhaji Ram, Penzaram and Nyariram, etc. May sound, light, and art movement be noticed by people and even then bring infinite benefit to sentient beings, liberating them by just saying, hearing, or thinking of them. Then, May those who are still not liberated recognize their impending birth 
and not enter into future rebirth. May they exhaust or imprint, uh, imprint for rebel in the six realms. Sigh with relief uh, in an emanation body and for 500 years in a pure land, having generated their own pure awareness. May they attain the air uh, reversible enlightenment. By just hearing this profound prayers of my uh, mind, may our sentient beings effortlessly, spontaneously realize ultimate truth. This view of effortless natural liberation. Having effortlessly, spontaneously realized it, may our sentient beings attain enlightenment in this life, pardo or in the pure realm. This I, Samedha Badra, say, is the king of all prayers. When recite, recited during eclipse of the sun or moon during thundal earthquakes, or when a Jokshin yogi is passing into nirvana, or those who hear the recitation will be liberated. I say, this prayer reveres the true nature of all phenomena. Everyone chant this or in compassing prayer. It has the same benefit as reciting all of the teachings. May this prayer uh, exhaust uh, samsara and empty the diluted world. <clears throat> Uh, this is the ultimate truth of uh, Akanista Samedabhadra, the source of whatever appeal abides in the brown, uh, brown, egg, egg, egg. Uh, of the heart with it is uh, crystal rock. Uh, this awareness, transmission, lineage of Rikpi Chichong. Rikpi Chichong. This is, means a uh, semi worthy. Explain to me a uh, Rikpa Rongsha. Those are for the uh, more um, uh, how to receive these uh, prayers. But then continually, uh, much exalted by disciples with faith in me. I wrote it down just as it came um, unuttered. Okay, so this is uh, from here, uh, the, some more information how to uh, receive this uh, prayers. Um, so, um, say that this Dharmakaya prayer requested by uh, Chaton. Choktor Timbi Nyama and Geshe Jansi. So they are requested the prayer. Uh, 
and then um, uh, was written down by the uh, ascetic of Sharjah, Tashi Jansen, uh, from expense of Rikpa awareness, it sub appeared Samantha Badra in her uh, wide eyed thumb side, thumb side body of light. So, thumb side body of light talk him. So then, then he, what then say? And I wrote down exactly what he said without alteration. So that's why the also oral transmission. Um, and may it become a cause for all beings to attend the king. Kingdom of Dharmakaya, Sarva Mongolan. Okay. So, <clears throat> also same as the, the, the this dedication, or meaning here, uh, there's a, because prayer for sometimes. We have a prayer for the um, prayer for God, prayer, prayer for the maybe holy beings like that is something uh, more maybe you don't have any you don't have uh, something fear of the many different ways, and then looking for the protection. So therefore the oh, prayer to God like that. Uh, yeah, of course for that is also a good reason. But here main point, the prayer for, for, uh, for yourself, yeah. We have uh, already the uh, wonderful uh, quality, inner, inner nature quality. So what we have problem right now, we never know about that. So then we cannot use it because we don't know. So the prayer meanings. Uh, May we, may sentient beings understand about it. So that is the main, main topic, main prayer. Yeah, so uh, uh, the, if, if, if recognize in this, this lifetime, and then maybe possibility we have some experiences. And then in during the part though, and maybe recognize for that person. So that is also one, one thing, prayer, right? So if, if that time, if part though time also, or, we cannot understand, but then we have prayer for another lifetime. Like we rebirth in pure land like that, or rebirth in the human being, and then we, we were uh, recognized. We were get, uh, we were achieved the achievement for the good realization. That is also another way. So there are some steps for the prayers, that, but many, main point the pr prayer for the understanding the nat nature of mind. 
not the uh, prayer for the God for like that, right? So the, you know the, this, this topic for or when we recite and then that is, that's therefore, therefore uh, our, our own general meditation is the activities of this prayer. Yeah. So, and also uh, say that uh, the benefit for like, yeah, resort, the prayers resort. Prayers resort for, we recite prayer, there's somebody uh, here for that, and then, oh, there may be, uh, may, may they uh, liberate soon. The three ways said here for all those who hear my prayer, may all things dispel into clear light mind. Uh, May all appearances are disappear into clear light. That is one, one point. The other thing, um, their physical body like uh, compound, compounded by aggregates that appear into uh, Light, luminosity, that is the second. So third one, say that order than in mind, disappear into pristine awareness. That is third point. So the result of the prayers or benefit for hearing somebody, benefit of yourself so, and also the ultimate benefit also that um, yeah therefore very special uh, prayers uh, not just hoping not not just hoping what they do what buddhas do for example <laughs> yeah like yeah somebody high level uh, uh, quality in, in the heaven, heaven or pure, and then you like, oh, bring me to heaven, bring to pure land. Not like that. So understanding the true nature, and then the whole of uh, the like, uh, appearances are uh, is dissolved into the light, inner light. Yeah, that is the that is the uh, final goal. Okay, so um, and also uh, the prayer is also uh, uh, related to our uh, daily life. Because our daily life for the mm, uh, something happening and not comfortable for physical body, not comfortable the mental mentally, something comes with uh, emotions and outer objects like society something problem. 
So that is uh, uh, oh, that is not said. Oh, please remove this. You request it to God or Buddha or something, did you? So here, not that directly. So here, what say that? Or phenomena within baseless, rootlessness spontaneously appear and are liberated within me. All extent phenomena are well established. Um, yet their essence is empty space. So here said. Uh, I don't say they are truly existent. May all sentient beings be freed. So, <clears throat> daily life, we have uh, uh, emotions or uh, uh, the appearance problem, what have issues we have there in uh, our mind sometimes anger and maybe sad maybe fail whatever so here say um, <clears throat> whatever appears that is it uh, liberate it's up dependency See wrong <clears throat> so that is part of a prayer also. <clears throat> that prayer is not <laughs> not uh, not request action. The actions not request to the God. So the the actions just you can do yourself. So even say that. No, uh, see, uh, no, see, like, and they could show Namka show Tibetan Namka the space. No, see, means appearance or universe. Universe, whatever the uh, establishing the very beautiful for like city, right? <laughs> so, uh, whatever they establishing wonderfully or whatever the very terrible things. Right, everything. Um, yeah, so uh, yet their uh, essence is empty space. Uh, say that the essence of empty space. Uh, we translate like that, but uh, the different way, the whatever establishing or the our phenomena or universe, but um, uh, the space is always in there. Space, uh, yeah, the space, space is uh, like this directly, the space engaging into everywhere. Which means the space extends into everywhere. So that means the in your inner emptiness when we have meditation balance. So the daily emotions, whatever arising, but the the space in there. If who not who who not make uh, make sense? The, who 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 not understand, and then there's nothing happened because they don't have connection for their understanding. Yeah, so therefore, um, the basic, the the action of make or prayer, this prayer is. The, our recognition and understanding of the true nature. That's only.
Okay. Okay. Now, if you have some question, and now we have time to question and answer. Okay. Oh, yes, hello. Hello. Mm -hmm. Good morning. This is Michael. Good. Oh, good, good morning. You. Yes. Um, you mentioned uh, the possibility of uh, as a sort of alternative to uh, uh, going directly to the nature of mind or ha having that realization. You mentioned uh, making prayers to be born in a pure land. Uh, and I guess from the pure land, then coming to the realization of nature of mind. And when you now when you say pure land, you're not talking about a, a an ordinary uh, deva realm, like a, a like in the six realms, the, the so-called deva realms. This is something uh, uh, superior. I, I want to say superior. In other words, it's not it's not samsaric. It, but when you say a pure land, that would be a place where all the beings are are, are endeavoring to realize uh, the, the nature of mind. That can you can you define what you mean what uh, pure land in the sense that you were using it? What that means? That means. Uh, uh... If, <clears throat> if this life or, or during part of time as if not uh, the result complete and then the prayer like you take uh, birth in pure land. That pure land is not an ordinary uh, land usually we uh, think about it uh, say the pure land is just the, uh, some Buddhas and holy beings they prayers the result of prayers they prayers for the uh, happening like that land so then this already have happening at the existence that land, not ordinary land. Mm. For like it, like it, um, what do we say? Almost artificial, right? Artificial mm -hmm. land, maybe. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the spiritual artificial land. It's yeah. not a... a like the we have elements in the in the ordinary elements, maybe the special elements, special art, special water, special trees, and because it is a, 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 the result of the uh, the holy banks, the prayers for like the size and the how much the what do we say the um, establishing the um, improvement and facilities so mostly the facilities to practice dharma there so then even the in general in Buddhism says uh, mm. ordinary people also they uh, pray for the, uh, birth in uh, pure land and mm. they were born in pure land and mm. then they, uh, they they have the opportunity to practice dharma without obs uh, obstacles Mm -hmm. And then much easy to progress there, easier than in 
because this land is there, there's a lot of obstacles. So in the pure land is there's no obstacles for the uh, process for uh, uh, practice Dharma. And then of course, then here say the 500 years like that, 500 years continually you practice Dharma and then of course you will get the high level achievement. Hmm. Okay. Very good. That makes Thank sense. You. Yes, Krishna. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Okay. Um, Geshula. Hello. Uh, hi, this is Kate. Um, uh, v V wanted me to ask you what. Um, the, the significance of the lamps are the lamps. The lamps. Mm -hmm. Okay, lamps, the lamps. Oh yeah, significant lamps. Lamps is uh, lamps is the, the uh, what do we say the um, like a door, door of the light. The door of the light, which means uh, uh, always say uh, in the teaching, inner light, the topic of inner light, inner luminosity. It is, it is not only belief system. So it is just, you can see, uh, when you practice and then you can see. So uh, how to see uh, the, 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 the path of luminosity, the source of luminosity, the door of luminosity. The door is the, the, the signs of luminosity came up, maybe came out maybe. Yeah. So came out the through the door doors, uh, lamps, lamps. So that is, you have some different practice for doing meditation. Sometimes you can practice in the uh, dark room. Then you can see through eyes, but there's no light, out, outer light, but you can see through eyes some uh, same as usual. That is not not helped from the uh, sunlight. So therefore, um, that is the. Now you you know now oh, there is light now. If somebody is not believe, and then you can do that practice, and then. You can see, and then now you believe in it. So, yeah. Like that, okay? Gishala, can I ask a question? Oh, yeah. Is it okay to do this, to uh, recite this prayer as a daily practice or whenever one wants, or is it only for special occasions? Oh, yeah, this isn't a, if, if people uh, do this main, main practice, main daily, daily practice prayer, that is a wonderful. But for me, I never see for, so better than this, this teaching, this prayers, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. So, uh, the the prayer, this become prayer, this become meditation practice, become the study also, become rem remembering for the meditation and whole, I think 84,000 this teachings, too much, we cannot read it always. Cannot recite many always, but can recite 
every day possibility right or or sometimes maybe one, once a week so i guess they we, uh, we don't need any others only if we have this uh, this can there every day they don't need any others mm. this is my my belief <laughs> okay. 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 Uh, one other question, uh, okay. the Jung, what is the Jung Drung body? Oh, Jung Drung body, a Jung Drung body is like a, Jung Drung is the swastika. Mm -hmm. So this is Tibetan uh, Jung Drung. Jung Drung is very deep meaning. Um, yeah, Jung. Jung means peacefully. Peace, peacefully, there's mind or whatever, actions, whatever, peaceful or compassion, loving kindness, the meaning is the young, young. So that is also a uh, Tibetan, my language also, uh, my uh, uh, place, hometown, uh, uh, used for young, is the some animals, they is very calm, they said young, yeah. So that is the loving kindness and compassion meaning. And Tong means, uh, Tong means like the same as pervaded by, pervaded by, or closer, or uh, yeah, or like the same as the muda, muda for the um, said, said, right? Said. That means sealed by the ultimate nature. So everyone or appearance are uh, sealed by the nature of mind, the inner space. That means tongue. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But the Jung Drung body, is that something, does that mean like an eternal body you, when is it attains or what does that mean? Oh, the body is like a ko, Tibetan say ko. So that mm. is uh, the body is the, uh, there is, can be say many different bodies, outer, inner, secret body. So, uh, but not just form, not like a form, right? Sometimes possible form or with color, with size, with shape, but um, the body could be the, um, sometimes body is like a uh, part of mind. Sometimes body is part of energy. Sometimes body is part of the um, luminosity, light. Yeah, sometimes this this core the body, but not the not like those those, but also it could the emptiness is body could name is body, but not the form, not the uh, light. Some there is uh, could be many different names. Mm -hmm. okay. Thank you. Good. Okay. Geshela? Yes. Uh, Petra, I have a, I have a question uh, from yes. page page two. Okay. There's page written, two. yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, may the mind be wrapped by the profound four initiation. What what is exactly the meaning of four initiation? Mm -hmm. You can say the uh uh where from you can can you tell me again? Yeah. The, um, what? May the minds be ripened by the profound four initiations. Uh, maybe six, uh -huh. seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, twelve sentence. Okay. Uh huh. I can say there is some twelve. Idea. Yeah. Twelve lines. Keep the mind. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, jackened by obscuration is coming up. Yeah, so 
so this is a uh for example if someone introduce the natural mind and but uh, the some pers- uh, some people uh, the idea is different there is mind uh, focusing very differently um for example we into the oh this the, the, the you can do like this, the non dual. So they explain about non dual. Then somebody, oh, that's not make sense. Um, so they, they feel, feel feeling uh, that the, the, it is not good idea, right? <laughs> Thinking like it. So then difficult to uh, uh, the understand. So they have a lot of dogs. They have a lot of the wrong view, like wrong, say the wrong view, the opposition view. So then those people are very difficult because um, they already um, bake uh, karma, right? Uh, so then if, if like this happened for me, here say, if this happened for me in now, um hope the in the future life change right because at this life time is very hard to understand because the wrong view the understanding differently so then in the future life time they get the the good person right so <laughs> then the mind is uh, trained on this so then see the wonderful Lama uh, teacher and then learn about the true nature. So then uh, what do we say? Uh, the step by step, the their process, process for the uh, experiences and uh, through initiation, four initiations, right? So four initiations, we have outer initiation, ah. in, in, inner, uh, outer, inner, second, and the more second, four initiations. Oh, yeah. okay. That is mostly we have the higher Tandara teaching, we have four initiations. But this used word the, uh, about that, but uh, mm, uh that is uh, this initiation introduction is like the the most executive initiation okay so therefore here the main point is in this lifetime very hard time to understand then you pray in the next time next lifetime then persist uh, step by step through the four initiations, finally you will get the, uh, the meaning of ultimate nature. So that is here the prayer. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And this initiation includes the the lung and the wang. Oh, this initiation is inclusion, uh, including uh, that is. Uh, this initiation is the the most sec, most secret initiation, but uh, uh, someone need process long term take long term, uh, okay. and they need outer initiation inner initiation. They they need the understanding or initiation uh, should be uh, step by step. Go oh, yeah. that that way. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay.
Yeah, I say that um, if you can, um, good for if you have time, they're yeah, good for practice the, this, this prayer or uh, um, maybe the daily prayer or, or the weekly prayer or monthly prayer. You can do this is very important. Yeah. And uh, um, you can remember for the teaching or essence of the uh, bond, everything here. Then the, our, uh, the other, uh, um, other uh, teachings, uh, usually I talk the teaching. Um, those are the commentary, commentary of the more details for how, how, how is the meaning. Yeah. Okay. Good. Maybe uh, today we finish this here. Okay. And uh, maybe we can recite the short short the dedication prayer can you uh show the last uh, the regular prayer book Kate? yeah yeah i yeah. know I, I i didn't have that open i'm sorry i'm gonna find it now take me a second oh, okay um sorry. dedication prayer okay hang on oh uh, yeah ah uh, yes okay let me we share have this. In, in website. Yep, I've got it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, last page. Okay. Let's see. Page 16, right? Oh, I think, yes, you can. Preview. Let's see. Okay. There we are. Good, good. Yeah, wonderful. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> so what uh, I mentioned the very beginning for we uh, the purpose of the uh, the prayers you can remember for this topic, and we decide now the first English. Or pure virtues that I have done through the three doors, I dedicate for the welfare of all sentient beings of the three realms. After having purified all karmic obscurations of the three times, may be swiftly accomplished heard of the three parties. Again, Tibetan. Gosan Dime Gavakumba Kamsam Okay, thank you so much for everyone. And uh, yeah, we have uh, had very wonderful uh, opportunity to practice today and you can um, recite this uh, uh, from the 
you can get from the website, Kuznogar uh, Center dot org. Yeah, so that is uh, through you get the website. You can recite that. Yeah, so and then tomorrow we have uh, the Sunday, first Sunday teaching. <laughs> first Sunday teaching we have tomorrow. And also, um, I don't know next, maybe uh, you can see that we have inner yoga uh, teaching, Mother Tandra. That is also uh, next Saturday. Start, uh, I think three Saturdays, we have that program also. Okay, thank you. Thank you, uh, Thank you, Delek. Thank you, Gatwa. Wonderful day you. and night. Thank you, Keshela. Thank you. Thank you so much, Keshela. Tashi Delek. Tashi Delek. Tashi Delek. Tashi Delek.